The program is right on schedule and under budget, thanks to the expertise of top-notch design engineers, flight technicians, and a team of four very dedicated test pilots. Becoming a test pilot is actually easier than coming to terms with why uh, you become a test pilot. Everything becomes routine after about six months. So the test pilot was a way, I thought, to see something new, see something different, and make a contribution. I'm more of a detective type. I love technology. I love new things. I love I love to go and, uh, and try out new things and see if I can find things that are wrong, that may be a mysterious problem that we can't figure out. We're all type A people. Um, we're all aggressive type people um, that pretty much know what we want. To work on a team, however, you have to listen to other people and you have to be willing to compromise on some things. I think one of the principal attributes of a test pilot is a curiosity. You have to want to know why something's doing what it's doing. I'm often asked by people uh, I fly with, what does it take to be a test pilot? What, can I be a test pilot, they'll say. And I ask them, uh, what's the exact speed of the tips of your rotor right now? He won't answer. He doesn't know. Test pilots have to know those things. And in fact, people who want to be test pilots probably have already asked those questions.